and today I'm here with my lovely assistant Ed and we're going to talk to you about the Fleming's response. Now Fleming's response is, um, you've probably seen it, um, it's when your horse curls his upper lip back in response to a certain kind of smell. So he curls his upper lip back, he sticks his head in the air and he makes all these snuffly noises. Um, <clears throat> so that's what the response is. But what is it and why do they do it? Well, mainly we see stallions doing it when they're sniffing a mare to see if she's ready to mate. So there is a huge reproductive response. But Fleming itself comes from a German word, which means um, to bear the upper teeth. And there's an upper Saxon German word, which also means spiteful. So that's where the word is derived from. However, I don't think they look spiteful at all. I think they look like they're laughing when they do it. So basically they turn, their, they pull their lip up, they stick their head in the air and they snuffle in and out. Now what this mechanism does is it draws the scent, usually pheromones or uh, strange smells, it draws it into the horse's nostrils and back into a little organ that sits at the base of the navel, nasal cavity called the vomer nasal organ or Jacobson's organ. And what that does is it takes, it's an accessory olfactory organ, and it takes that smell directly into the primal um, ancient parts of the horse's brain, the amygdala and the hypothalamus, so that he doesn't even have to process the smell, he gets an instantaneous response. And so, hence, it is linked to survival, reproduction, and possibly a fear response. And it's not just horses that do it, it's everything from horses, quite a few mammals do it, but everything from horses to big cats. So, we're going to have a go at trying to get Ed here to do a Fleming's response so that you can see what I'm talking about. I have some essential oils here and we're just going to give them a smell. try one more time. This time we're going to try with Ted. He's very suspicious of all these smells, so he's not quite sure what's going on, um, because we weren't meant to do the video at all with him today. So now we are going to have another go at seeing can we get a horse to do a Fleming's response for you, so you can see what we're talking about. So I have two essential oils in my pocket. We're going to start with balance, and we'll see if Ted will show us No, not quite sure, not quite sure. We'll try another one. This one is Melaleuca or tea tree. And that's a definite no for tea tree. We'll try the balance again. You can do it again. Have a go. There we go, that's the Flemings. And it's a definite yes for the mint. That's Roma signing off from um, Irish Sportswear Magazine, and don't remember to check our channel for new videos 
um, every week. Thank you.